everybody, it's Dagon Hills, and I have another guitar for you today. I think you can tell what kind it's going to be. Okay, let's open it up. This is my ESP LTD Deluxe, an MH1001 NT, which is no tremolo. There's a beautiful quilt top on it. It looks really dark, but in the light, it kind of lightens up and has a hint of green. But it really looks black without the light. This case didn't come with it. I bought this separately. And it was a dent and scratch. But it really has nothing wrong with it. I think one little scratch on the covering. And some people freak out. But it was a great deal. I love how the case, it really fits it perfectly. You can see right along there. Just absolutely a tight fit. Keeps it safe. I can't remember if it even came with a gig bag, but I wanted a case for it. And then there you can see the truss rod. I had a custom made little pearl cover for it. I wouldn't mind an anodized black one, but I haven't gotten it yet. Well, here you can see the back. It's a, it has a set neck, so it goes right through it. I love the way it plays. The heel there is just beautiful. You can see the grain. And, of course, it has active pickups, so it has a battery in there. It kind of looks like a coffin. There's where the strings go through. This is really an outstanding guitar. I think it plays as well as my Gibson and a lot of others. The neck is really beautiful. Well, let me put it on the guitar stand and show you some of its features. I haven't really done anything to it other than the little truss rod cover. Well, there it is on the guitar stand. You can see it has a string through body, a simple volume, a tone control. And a three-way switch it has active pickups. I wouldn't mind switching those out for some nice passive ones. The hardware is black chrome, so it gives it kind of a dark look. But it's really an awesome guitar. It really has a beautiful neck on it. You can see the inlay there, MH1001. Then it has little markers up along the top. You can see the triple line binding there. It's pretty cool. You can see the quilting there too. It's pretty awesome. And I put strap locks on it, of course. It has a two nomadic bridge. Then it has the 8185 Metalworks pickups by EMG. The neck is maple with a rosewood fingerboard. It has 24 frets. The logo looks like it's mother of pearl, but you can't really make it out on this. It has ESP locking tuners on it. Well, there you have it. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. And have a great day. Jagger.